Hey guys, welcome to the Ecom Family channel. My name is Edson. And I'm Andrea, the wifey. And today we're doing our episode three on what sold last week. Before we get started, what I want to do is I want to go over what our eBay account showed and as well as did we have a record breaking day, which if you look at the screen, you're going to notice we did have one amazing day. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, we like those results. Looking real quick, it looks like uh, today we made 182 on one account and 49 on another. 2,429 on our big account. Yeah. 931 on Auction Supreme. For the for the week. For the week. Mm -hmm. The last 31 days uh, were up 8%, but check this one out. We're down 23%. Mm -hmm. I'll actually make a video explaining why this is and what I'm doing to make it uh, go back the other way. I think okay. we're going to um, be going into the holidays and this should turn around real quick, but there is a reason why it went down 23%. So yeah. with everything here, it looks like we made $3,360.69 on our eBay accounts. Now that includes all of our thrifting as well as our wholesale liquidation and all the other items that we sell on eBay. Okay, right, so we don't just do thrifting, we do some wholesale items. We do wholesale, we yeah. do a lot. And so let's let's get into our top 10 most interesting items that we we uh, were able to find. And if you remember, if you found it, let oh, us know. I'll, I'll for sure remember if I was the one who found it. Yeah, he gets to go more often than me. So I'll remember what I found. And you guys may remember me in prior videos. Um, these are items that, you know, that I say, wow, I'm always shocked to find, you know, what, uh, when you look an item up, what it sells for and then what we actually sell it for. It's, it's shocking. I mean, the world, uh, the world is giant on, on consuming and, and what they're looking for. <laughs> America. Right? America. America. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. So here we go. At number 10, a Tickle Me Elmo surprise. This was a 2000 vintage. Uh, ended up selling it for $10 with another $6 shipping. After the eBay fees and transaction fees, eleven seventy-five. Now we actually haven't shipped this one out yet. So depending on the size, it could cost maybe five, six dollars, okay. leaving us with around five, six dollars, which it's not too bad for an item that we found at the Goodwill Benz. Paid, I don't know, probably maybe a dollar if that. Yeah, okay. multiply that. And I just want to ask how many of you out there remember the big hype on Tickle Me Elmo in the <laughs> early two thousands. I have a. 23 year old and probably Dylan our 21 year old is probably still big when he yeah, was 21 yeah but this was a, a hot ticket item just interested to know if any of you guys remember the craze around the table yeah it was it was <laughs> yeah it was it was so hot that if you go out to the Google bench you find these all over the place oh yeah <laughs> so and people are still buying them. yep so here we go number nine we got a KMV switch HDMI two port USB switch okay now this is a Really small item, uh, found it in the electronics section of the, one of the bins. Ended up selling it for $10, another $6 shipping. $17.73 minus the transaction fee and everything, $13.63. We still need to ship it, it's gonna cost about $4, so we're still gonna make about $9. We're actually gonna make more on this one than we are on our typical home. Yeah, okay, yeah. All right, fully right. noted there, babe, all right. <laughs> okay, number eight. It's not a competition or anything, guys. The Trivia Pursuit Star Wars Classic Trilogy. This is a, a little uh, RTD2 that belongs to a, uh, video, uh, a board game. Uh, ended up finding it at the bottom of the one of the bins. Yeah. Uh, put it on there for $10. $6 shipping, total of $16.86. Now it looks like we actually already shipped it and transaction everything, so we earned nine dollars and sixty cents on this. Pump. And this was in electronics, so you said how much did this probably cost us? Sixty-nine cents a pound. So, so you know, and then we we also bought a ton of stuff. So probably fifty cent, maybe forty, fifty cents. Yeah, yeah, that's right. That. I mean, it was like this big, you guys. It's just this little little toy gadget game piece. <laughs> so again, shocker. Again, what these things go for? Yeah. Okay, coming in at number seven. We got the Disney Mickey's replacement plastic stand base. Okay, so I actually found the entire box with the uh, all the pieces, all the to, pieces it. to it. It's like and, a Christmas cuckoo clock. Yeah, it's a Christmas cuckoo clock. Decoration thing. And uh, I decided to throw it up on eBay to see, and I noticed that people were buying the parts to it. We had tons of the little parts, but we still kept the main thing. Uh, our son absolutely loves it, which is, uh, thank God it has a, a volume button, it's uh, <laughs> kind of loud. It's cute. Though. But we ended up selling the pieces for $10, uh, $5 shipping, 
1250 total uh, transaction fee is 202 1288 still looks like we need to ship it but still I'm making eight dollars around eight dollars on this item right here yeah and this is a, just stay right here a second this is a good uh, learning point that maybe you could do a video later on Edson's really good at at thinking of multiple ways that he could list or sell an item so he doesn't just stop at well let's let's take a picture and see what this one item would would sell for um, he'll look at well, what is the parts if I part this or if I put this together in a lot and he'll look at all those different things and, and try to come up with the best way to list it or maybe list it multiple ways um, and so yeah hopefully maybe later you can do a video kind of um, doing a teaching on that um, yeah. someday later for yeah, our okay so coming in at number six the has cargo white green plane working lights kids so I found this one <laughs> uh, Andrea found this one she, she definitely found this one um, our son played with it for a little bit, but the the wings like come off. It's kind of weird um, the way they built it. But uh, we put some batteries in. Everything works good. Ended up putting it on eBay uh, for twenty dollars, another ten dollars shipping. So all together, it was uh, uh, thirty dollars. Looks like thirty one ninety nine. Um, we got the transaction fee. We got the shipping. So we ended up making sixteen sixteen on this item that we probably paid maybe 50 cents for so yeah a great yeah. find and in all honesty i actually just thought this was a cool toy for christiana yeah so, yeah you know. yeah I, I didn't expect it to sell this quick so yeah you know, I, I didn't either hopefully he doesn't miss it okay so coming in at number five we got the nerf and strike elite curve banana 10 round clips okay these you can find on offer up at the goodwill bends at the goodwill stores and they sell really quickly, especially the banana clips. This is a 10 round clip. We ended up finding two right next to each other. Put them on there for $14.95, another $6. $22 after the shipping, everything is done. We made $10.15 on this And they, these are ones that I feel we sell all the time on eBay. We and do. you can find these at the Goodwill, at the Goodwills and Goodwill bins really easy. Um, again, I'm, I'm shocked at how often like these, these sale and at the prices they go for. Um, people are always looking for these. Yeah, okay, so coming in at number four, the Cleveland High Board XLS driver head cover. Okay, so this one, <laughs> Andrew found, <laughs> Andrew found this one, and uh, we ended up listing it. Uh, I believe he listed it for 15, but the guy wanted a, a special offer. He said 10, so I took it. Ended up um, selling for 17.51. Shipping transaction fees, ad fee standard, two dollars for ad fee standard BS, <laughs> and a total of seven dollars and twenty five cents. So for something uh, that it was super light, you guys. Super so light. We got it at the bins. So. Super easy. Okay, coming in at number three. So now we are at the top three items that we found most interesting that we sold last week. Okay, so here we go. The Taylor Swift Ooh, Eras Tour remember, movie. Remember, she's official. on fire. Forty four ounce. This is the second cup we've sold. Yep. And we ended up selling it for $19.95, another $6 for shipping, $27.71. After the transaction fee, shipping and everything, we made $15.51 on an item that we actually got for free. This is yeah. the second item that ended up in our sink, sink. Yep, not off. washed. It was just there for a few days and yep. we decided, ah, why don't we just put it on there and see what happens. Yep. So, bam, we sold it for $26. Mm -hmm. Okay, coming in at number two, the Nun Adult Halloween Costume. Okay, so this one uh, found again out at the Goodwill Benz. Uh, everything was there, Everything uh, uh, it was literally brand new. Yeah. And took this item, listed it on eBay, sold it for 15. I think we sold it the day after Halloween, actually. Pretty soon, yeah. Um, it was the day after, yeah, it was the day after Halloween. It was kind of oh. crazy. Uh, but we sold it for 15, $6, so 22 26 after the transaction fee, shipping fee, twelve dollars and eleven cents. So on this item that we found, okay. And so now for our number one, what we thought was the most interesting items that we what sold last is week. What it? What do we got? Is the Ninja Blender lid? This Only one replacement for it. I found this one. Yeah, yeah. Guys, you go out there either at the Goodwill Benz, at any Goodwill, you're gonna find these Ninja Blender. Anything Ninja Blender as parts, you literally can sell the resell the parts individually, and you'd be surprised what people are paying for it. For this lid alone, we ended up selling it for twenty dollars. Threw in another ten dollars wow. for shipping. 
Um, the shipping, I think, was $4, $4, 4 50 So 32, oh, there it is, right there. 4 44 was the shipping. Mm -hmm. And all together, we ended up making $18.38. Wow. So uh, lit, uh, Ninja Blender lids, um, vacuum the cleaner cups. parts, the cups, yeah. all those things that you can find. If the you're bottoms, looking, the twists, bottoms yeah, for some of them. I the twist, if, if you're looking for items to sell on eBay, we recommend that you check out the Goodwill Benz, Offer Up, Facebook Marketplace. Mm -hmm. You're going to be able to find a lot of items that you can resell on eBay. Personally, for us, we love the Goodwill Benz. It's the best for our money. We're mm -hmm. able to. In time, because it's all in one place. It's, yeah. Some people do garage, yeah. Uh, garage sales and stuff like that. Yeah. Like, yeah. No, I, I really like the Goodwill Benz. Mm -hmm. It just gets everything out of the way and we're able to find a uh, great product. So. And this is another example of what I brought up earlier and where Edson's good at looking up items to sell for, you know, looking at parts and pieces because mm -hmm. um, there's there's people looking for that. Yeah. Okay, guys. All right. So that is the end of our top 10 items that we sold last week on eBay. Please don't forget to subscribe. Click that like button. And as always. <laughs> as always. Here's to our success. Take care. No? Uh, well, we just kind of discussed that. That was okay. You know, okay. But, uh, but yeah, check us out. Subscribe, guys. Keep watching us for weekly. Uh, the the most interesting items that sell. As you keep watching and following us, you'll you'll get uh, ideas of what to look for at the Goodwill bins or whatever your thrift shopping is in your local area or maybe Facebook Marketplace. And uh, you can start your, your own eBay store and start making a, a living, a side hustle or full time um, one day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's, our, that's our goal is to one day, both of us be full time, reselling on eBay, teaching others how to make money on eBay. And so if you're interested in any of those things, do make sure and click on that subscribe button, like this video, share it with your friends, and we will make sure and see you on the next video. Yeah, you guys and check have a great night. Check out our store. Yeah, if you see anything you like and want to buy. Bye guys, take Bye care. Bye guys, take care.